surprise. Are you ready for this? Yes. Give me that clippy that was in that cup. Yes, the protege. Make yourself useful for God's sakes. For God's sake. Okay. Okay. We're getting ready <laughs> to go to the grand prize. I need everybody to be careful. Oh, God. You just let me and Brittany lead you. I already don't believe you. Gotcha, we gotcha. Mm. All right, you're step. We're going door. out the door. Going out the door. Okay. We're gonna go down the step. <laughs> Did anybody bring a flashlight? <laughs> okay, one. I'm fine. Just one Every, step. Everything. Okay, down. Oh, you're good. <laughs> you. She's got this. She's okay. got this. She's got this. She's got this. <laughs> Protege, are you doing all right? I'm good. for simple rewards and consequences. Okay. <laughs> All right. Now, what we're going to have to have, we are going to have to have an assistant who is willing to assist. How about you? Uh, I'll, I'll help. Okay. Can I take off my first? Yeah. You just got here, my glasses? We're already fogging up. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, ladies, later on there might be 
you some photo opportunities, but we're not exchanging numbers because I'm already shackled. All right. <laughs> <laughs> now we're going to talk about today's sponsors. Today's sponsors of the game, Static Guard <laughs> and Palo Industries. As you know, Palo products can really make a difference in somebody's life. Okay. Now, the way we're going to work this <coughs> is we've actually sequestered off. I know you think that your fiance is fishing. But he's not. No, he's not. We've got him sequestered away in a super quiet room where he cannot hear what you're saying or see you. Let's look at the monitor. Hey, say hello to me. Say hello. I already told you, he can't see you or hear you. You're gonna have to be smarter than that to win this game. Okay. Now what we're going to do. My assistant. As we ask you questions, for every one you get right, she's going to give you one poo ticket. <laughs> you are playing for Palo's Pinch Paper. <laughs> for every single ticket you get, you get a roll of Palo's Finest. <laughs> now, as you see, this is government paper. <laughs> Able to take on government shit. Here we go. <laughs> now, but for every one you get wrong, <laughs> You get a piece of gum. Oh, frighten the old pie hole. Are you ready? Ready. <laughs> okay. Now, I want everybody to know, just for safety, we offer federal protection and witness relocation. So there's nothing to worry about. Let's get on with some of our questions. <laughs> Do you have your bed? <laughs> That's your answer. Okay, here is the first question. Complete the following sentence. A perfect wife is one who blank. She says is happy. Let's see what Nick says. Always there to support her husband. Oh, it looks like a piece of gum. Oh, no. Kelsey's friends would look best in a gypsy movie. Excuse me. These are easy. Come on, you can't get these wrong. Okay. She says, Sarah. Let's see what Nick says. Oh, <laughs> see, see, of course. Looks like another piece of gum. <laughs> We asked him if Helsky would send him to a body shop, what would she have fixed or repaired? <laughs> if Kelsey could send Nick to a body shop, what would she have fixed? <laughs> well, she an answer. She answered exhaust. <laughs> <laughs> he says he'd have his back fixed. <laughs> Apparently you think his exhaust is dysfunctional. That's something you might should be talking about. Oh no! <laughs> we have to talk about to make him out that exhaust. <laughs> okay. Oh my god. <laughs> who would Kelsey say was the best, better catch out of the two of you? Who do you think Nick says is the better catch between you? No, two? who would Kelsey say? Who does oh. she say is the better catch? Oh, let's see. Can she possibly get one right? <laughs> drum roll. Budget cuts took the drum. A poo ticket for you! Finally! <laughs> We've got poo tickets flowing! <laughs> Here we go. Complete the following sentence. A perfect husband is one who blank has good exhaust. <laughs> <laughs> Supports his wife. Did I was wrong earlier? <laughs> Nick says respects and provides for his wife. I would say that's a win. I would say. <laughs> okay, we'll let it be a win. <laughs> Another poo ticket. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going home with two rolls, twenty. 
Here we go. When Nick goes to work, I start my blank. <laughs> day. <laughs> Starts her day. God, we're Let's see what Nick has to say. <laughs> Netflix, Netflix binge. <laughs> <laughs> Start your next piece of gum. <laughs> Here we go. Number seven. What candy bar would Kelsey choose to describe your love life? Snickers, zero, payday, $100,000 bar, mounds, big hunk, or something different? <laughs> the way she chews that gum, who knows what? <laughs> Will it be Snickers? Snickers? <laughs> Let's see what Nick says. Hershey's, Hershey's Kiss! Oh. Oh. He used the better catch. <laughs> Looks like Gum is a big winner here today. <laughs> this is a great game where you don't win much, but big wrong answers can get you in big trouble. <laughs> Number eight. What is the strangest gift Nick has ever brought with you? Hmm. Think about it. Could mean another piece of gum. <laughs> <laughs> what do you think? God, bro. Strangest gift? <laughs> <laughs> like our character for him? <laughs> A book. A book. <coughs> Nick said, gum. <laughs> <laughs> a shower head. <laughs> How can you forget something like that? <laughs> I was thinking like a random gift. Like, oh, Ooh, here's a good one. Oh my Very God. important for you to be in tune with this one. What percentage of the housework would you say your fiance says they do? <laughs> Grunts are not acceptable answers. Half. Half? Half? Like, I'd say he said he does half. Oh, he says you do 75. Wow, he's giving him more than I thought. That means you start telling him to pay him some slack. He owes you 25%. <laughs> You've got it writing. <laughs> oh, I forgot. To we can use the plunger. <laughs> she had one for you. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Number 10. When you first met Kelsey, what would they say was the one thing which first caught their attention about you? Like what I made them? What? <laughs> you can write it down. <laughs> when he first met you, what would you say? What stood out to me? Your gum chewing. <laughs> <laughs> Your Palo products. Speaking my mind. Speaking her mind. Speaking her mind. Let's see what Nick says. <laughs> <laughs> Have we had been through a lot of the same things? Oh, oh gosh, what rags. I don't know how to do this one. Hey, we may have to make another gum run. <laughs> oh, oh we'll let that one lay there. We'll let that one go. <laughs> Before so you choke. Cool. <laughs> <laughs> you have to give her a reprieve on the chewing. <laughs> Number 11. Relax, there's only 45 questions. <laughs> Which song best describes your first day? Sea of Love, Man Eater, Our Lips Are Sealed, or Cold as Ice? Our <laughs> first date. <laughs> Think it over. Everybody will see your answer. Nick says. <laughs> 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 That's what 
she began to write. I know. <laughs> but if you know who sings it, you can spit out the gum and start over. There's a chance. Who sings Our Lips Are Sealed? Think it through. <clears throat> Our Lips Are Sealed. Does anybody know here in the room? You get one call out to your friends. It, one, yes. <laughs> oh, man, I'm joking. Okay. <laughs> Who sings Our Lips Are Sealed? April. April should know. But I know. It's the Go Go's. The Go Go's. But does she want to use it in your favor? I'm joking. <laughs> <laughs> she coughed up her liver. <laughs> okay. Number 12. Breathe. <laughs> yeah, I need water now. I got Kelsey Rumjata. could change jobs. What was her dream job? Or up on the table. What does Nick think your dream job is? Probably. Thank you, Protege. Hairstylist. Hairstylist. Oh, my goodness. Healthcare yeah. or beautician. Oh, All right. Have a drink. Yeah. Best price. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> She's had enough. Get that gum away. <laughs> and she gets Notice a, that gum's she coming out of the wine glass. <laughs> she gets <laughs> Pay attention, Gumby. Here we go. <laughs> what will Kelsey say is your favorite food? What is Nick's uh, favorite food? <laughs> Burgers or Chinese? Burgers or Chinese? Let's see what Nick says. Cheeseburger! Look at that! Cheeseburger! Everybody give her a hand! You're doing fine. <laughs> if you had a day off alone and could do whatever you wanted, what would Nick say it would be? Hmm. A whole day. Just you. A woman and her thoughts. Money's no option. What would you do? <clears throat> she would erase her first answer. <laughs> a long, indecisive day. We can do a quick promo for Paolo's bow ties. Paolo's bow ties made out of organza. Oh man. <clears throat> yeah. I would say buy books and read. Buy books and read. <laughs> Let's That's see what probably it says. Lounge around the couch and Lounge watch on the movies. couch and watch movies. <laughs> but one of its movies is the book she read. That was my first, that was what I was going to write. The first time I was like, no. You can get them yourself. I know. Open Sesame. sesame. <laughs> I want you to know I sport all the Palo products. Palo's a good friend of mine. I owe everything to Palo. My house, car, all my money. Just goes to show you, don't play poker with Palo. <laughs> <laughs> what color was the front door on the very first place you lived together? Who does remember that, right? Right. Everybody remembers that. You couldn't possibly get this one wrong. Sinister laughter. that gum smack. White? White. That's a pretty good guess. What does Nick say? White! Wow. Yeah. Wow. Two tickets all around. Two <laughs> tickets all around. Yeah, everyone gets a poo ticket. Yay, poo ticket! Poo ticket for everyone. Woo. Terrence, Terrence, look at the poo tickets. Poo tickets. Terrence will recognize the poo tickets. <laughs> Compliments of Obama. <laughs> Don't mind the little thing. Sixteen. <laughs> if Nick could have constant access to one store. What would it be? How well do you know Nick when you're not around? <laughs> mm. 
Academy or Bass Pro? Academy or Bass Pro. Let's see what Nick says. <laughs> All that hard them. thinking's paying off. I smell the sawdust from here. <laughs> 17. What is your favorite comfort food? KFC mashed potatoes and gravy? Oh, yeah, oh, okay. <laughs> okay. okay, okay, the name is. Nick's? Yes. Oh. Why are we going to answer? <laughs> Probably a cheeseburger. We don't know because I don't have that one. Give me a blue ticket. <laughs> What would Nick say is one item of clothing you wear that he just cannot stand? <laughs> Ooh, she has an immediate answer. <laughs> Grandma Lynn shirts. Grandma Lynn shirts. <laughs> This could be a learning moment. <laughs> Surely it isn't that get up. You must love that outfit. Yeah, I love it. Here we go. All of your clothes. <laughs> <laughs> That's appropriate. I can't all. That oh. could mean a lot of things. Oh. I thought you were sticking it on my face. <laughs> oh. He either hates your clothes or he likes to see you out of them. <laughs> Here we go. When Nick leaves the house, what time is it? Party time, time to clean, or nap time? <laughs> Party time. Party time. Let's see what Nick says. <laughs> Party time. <laughs> He knows you pretty well. So he picked all of them. Mm -hmm. He picked all of them. <laughs> he knows me. Oh, we already have this one. Three B. Um. Well, that's three B. Yeah, yeah, that's you know. Yeah, it's it's go ahead. The consolation prize. <laughs> Who would you say was uh, the better catch? Who would I? Oh, okay. Damage control. <laughs> Nick still. A safe bet. <laughs> safe bet. Yeah. You both claim each other. Give her a poo ticket. Okay. Because the poo in here is getting thick. <laughs> oh my good. There's the safety dance and there's the safety answers. <laughs> what would Nick say is his greatest attribute would be? <laughs> It's his sunglasses. <laughs> <laughs> what would Nick say? Mm -hmm. What's his high point? She can't think of anything good. Yours <laughs> oh, <laughs> is your hair. Let the record show she's undecided. <laughs> <laughs> Working hard. Working, Working hard. hard. His eyes. <laughs> 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 Looks like gum. <laughs> oh. Hey, Gumby. Here, put the elbow drop this one. Here's a good one. Who takes the longest to get ready in the morning? Wait a minute, they don't get ready in the morning. <laughs> <laughs> Confidently says her. <laughs> yeah. Kelsey! Yay! Woo! Woo! She really needs to turn this game around. Pello <laughs> wants you to have your wallet's well, gonna be full. <laughs> Who drives the worst? <laughs> Is it two in a row? Kelsey! <laughs> I hear 
your resignation there. Jeez. Oh. <laughs> Is this three in a row? Could it be? Yes. <laughs> Turkey. Good job. Give her a hand. But we have a three in a row bonus. You get an extra food ticket. Yay. <laughs> Gonna be a piece of gum. <laughs> <laughs> okay, number 25. What is your Brad's favorite non alcoholic drink? What would he say is your favorite non alcoholic drink? Think it over. Fruit juice? <laughs> you fire? Okay. Warm milk? Fruit juice. Coke? Hook. Let's see what Nick has to say. Dr. Dr. Pepper! <laughs> oh, goosey! I was, I was gonna write that because I recently stopped liking Coke. Damn it. <laughs> Here's the final question. Think deep. If Kelsey was your dog, what would her breed and name be? <laughs> <laughs> Get out of here. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know how to spell Chihuahua. <laughs> Chihuahua. Chihu. Chihu. I don't know. Um. <laughs> I'd be Chihuahua, my name would be Small. Small? Smalls. Small. Okay. Small. <laughs> Let's see what Nick says. <laughs> Are you ready? Yes. I got your tail. <laughs> Name <Named> Sassy. <laughs> <laughs> Let's give her a hand, folks. Yay! 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 And don't forget to take all of your Palo Pinch paper. Yeah. <laughs>